I don't understand it, but the ship makes. One hundred pokos. Okay then, just got back to my own plan, now I have to go back to that plan just to get some more stuff. Just to pay off our debt. Well, time to go back to my reunion with my Pikmin. It's been about a year, but I'm finally going back there. Repose. Ugh, can I ever get a safe landing on a planet? That was close. I have averted a crash landing running. Diagnose. Alert danger! Louis is missing. He must have somehow fallen out of his cockpit. He is not responding via his communicator. He is either floating, protonal, or in danger. Almar, you must find Louis before he freezes to death in the cold of this planet. Wait a moment, look! Huh? Oh, it's that guy again. Could these be Pikmin? They look like they are about to be devoured as we speak. No, it looks like they're about to beat that guy up. I already know how to play this game. Anyway, hey guys, Sergeant Mario 101 here. Welcome to our new Let's Play of Pikmin 2. Um, 
Anyway, so of course we see Pikmin here. Calm would be. The Pikmin ran to your side. They seem to remember you, Captain Olimar. How fascinating. Give them instructions, yeah. Basically, you just hold hold the A button. To, whoa! Hold the A button to grab one and throw it at an enemy. If I can. I was gonna try to do the instant death kill, but I couldn't. Anyway, let's take him back. Attention, Captain Olimar. I have just re-established my communication link with Louie. It is fortunate that we have managed to confirm his safety. Okay, press Y to communicate with him. Alright. Louie. Louis, allow me to as assess your condition as per our safety pro protocols. Are you at all injured? No. If I was injured, I wouldn't be at full health. Yes, okay, press bonus contact, okay. Now, I got a few things to say. I'm just wondering, are you guys happy that I'm let's playing this game? I mean, it's been about a year since I've let's played the original Pikmin. Just want to know. Are you glad that I'm helping the sequel? And would you like to see a let's play of Pikmin 3? And probably the bigger question is, though, hold on, let's watch this first. Louis, the odd object before you appears to be one of the onions mentioned in Captain Almar's report. I added the captain part. Because Almar is awesome. See, the onion injected just sprouted. According to Alma's report, it could be plucked with A. And now the other question I have to say right now is, um, if you're wondering why am I playing the GameCube version of Pikmin 2, well, let's see, um, I do own the Wii version, but I've not played yet, and I really do not have time to learn the Wii remote controls, so I'm just decided to use the GameCube controls because I'm used to them. Louis, this must be one of the Pikmin creatures from Olimar's report. It is staring at you. You see the you can you see the issue objectives here, Pikmin? Disband your squad with A. Interesting. Olimar's description of the of the creatures resembling pick pick carrots was strikingly accurate. Louis, my sensors have detected drool in the corner of your mouth. Are you alright? Huh? <laughs> uh, a new buddy. Anyway, just have him hit these flowers and carry those pellets, and he will bring those to the onions and create more Pikmin. Now, even though that says one, you're probably thinking it'll bring up just one pick, but, but but no. Since it matches the color of the onion, we'll get two. Amazing how they're grown in the snow. The onion ejected more seeds. The pellet from that flower must hold nutrients that breed Pikmin. Yes, the Pikmin gather nutrients, haul them to... The onion and further propagate yeah, comes, yeah. mothership. Now there's something I don't get about the Pikmin. Okay, this in this game, like something suggestive. Okay, if I can, no, I can't. I was going to bring them inside the onion so you could like hear something, but I can't now, unfortunately, because it's not letting me. But I will do that in a later time. For now, let's just focus on getting Pikmin. Pluck them. 
so we can get enough Pikmin and then get back to Olimar. How's he doing? Ah, uh, I see. They're trying to get. They're trying to bring him back to the base. Not the base. I mean the onion. It's actually been a while since I played Pikmin, so I actually, to be honest, I'll be honest with you, I completely forgot the name of the enemies. <laughs> oh, wait, I remember now. It was a bulb orb. Yeah. Perhaps this object is one of the treasures that we are searching for. The only reason we found it here is because this is where you crash landed. How fortunate. I would like to appraise it. But you must regroup with Almar first. Can you see him? Yeah, is L to move the camera behind you? It's more like R. You can go in this little mode. Yeah, I prefer it like this. Do you want to pick me up here? And there we go. We've regroup we we regrouped with Almar. Jump for joy. Captain Olimar, Louis, you are reunited at last. This has been a troublesome start to our trip. But now you must feel sure that your combined wits can get you through anything, correct? From now on, use B to form a single group, X to take solo action, and Y to change leaders. Okay. I'm sorry this probably hasn't been that interesting, but it's just, it's just part of the game, the beginning. Not that exciting. And I think I also, like I said, how I could never have a good landing on a planet. Well... Then again, I did land on my home planet safely. Hokate. Hokate. I don't know how you pronounce it. How many Pikmin do I need to carry that? Oh, wait, they have to dig it out first. Yeah, some treasures are stuck on the ground. You have to Pikmin have to dig it out. Twenty Pikmin? Okay, I'll wait for those guys to bring him over there, and and then we will carry this over here and get some money. Or Pocos, sorry, Pocos. Four Pikmin, okay. are the only enemy in this game that will never be able to kill Pikmin. Well, all the others can, but just that one specific one can never. Because it's part of the story. Come on. There we go. Now we just have to wait for them to drag that all the way over here. So we're doing that, why don't we look around, huh? Look around this place. Hmm. Mm, I see treasure over there. Hmm, a wall we can break. I think I see a snowman. Louie. Duh. Hmm. We haven't checked over here that much, though. Mm, water, we're gonna have to take care of that somehow. Can't climb on that stick. Or branch, whatever. <laughs> Not much, huh? Alright, guys, come on, move your ass. Sis. Two eighty. Courage reactor. Our first day of exploration has yielded our first treasure. We will be done in record time. 
I took the liberty of naming it when I when I appraised it. The name reflects my current thinking. Leave it to me to think up catchy names for hit products. It is but one of my many talents. We shall end our first day here and report back to our president. His face will surely be joyous. However, to communicate with Hakate, we must fly into low orbit above this planet. We will not return to the surface until morning, so as to avoid the injustious nocturnal creatures. Nocturnal. Report. Funds earned. Nice. Mo! You found your first bit of treasure. Find work. Our future depends on your efforts. So check your treasure hoard regularly. I'll check in often. Keep in pace. Let's save. You know what? I think that we'll call that an episode. You know. Enough for the first day. I say. So next time, we will go back to... So uh, next time on Let's Play Pikmin 2, we are going back to the Valley of Repose and try to find some more treasures, okay? See you guys then.